Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. It is the 8th of March and today we are stealing three parts of the Grounder Mark II while going as fast as possible. We are silent. We are tough. Alright. I always need to remember that we're silent because I forget. And then strategies that I try to do don't work. Oh, we got a conk hammer for bash dashing, an acid trap for maybe doing something, and some visitors. Uh, interesting. I don't feel like we have a chance at getting under 10 seconds on all three ships for this one. Uh, glitter ship, yeah, especially. Don't think that's gonna happen. Uh, we are going up against armor, so our traps aren't irrelevant completely. But we also don't strictly need to take out anyone that's wearing armor, so... Not quite a direct approach, but not the worst. That's a bad key. Um, that's also a bad key. So there's no way I'm just like visiting and getting past because I I'd also need to get that key. And even okay, this is an annoying ship. I'm almost considering using a visitor to get this crate and just ignoring this group completely. Uh... But I probably won't do that. I pick up a... I don't know, what is it? This feels like it's loud. Yeah, it's the normal volume. Might just be on my end. Okay. Uh, what was I saying? I'm gonna take you out. We're just going fast, so it's okay to kill. We're free to kill everyone. Uh, reinforcements. That actually would be annoying at this point, so we're taking you out as well. And I mostly knocked out them. Just in case they had an item. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's a good idea. If I don't need to use it, it's a good idea to have multiple visitors in case I get a slipstream. So then I can use multiple visitors all in one go. And that is a massive way to get a perfect style bonus on ship three. Oop. Uh, let's give you a shot. Give you a shot, and I'll throw this at you just in case you've got an item. Sure, let's pick up another gun and give you a shot. Nope. That's fine. Okay, now's the time to make the decision. The key is faster to get now. I'm lucky that this guard's body protects me from the defender. Yeah. 
I am slightly tempted to use a visitor to get the key and then get this, but eh. Alright. So I care about this window breaking. There we go. Not especially. But it looks like we're avoiding it breaking anyways. Okay. Nope, didn't mean to swap that out. What have we got? We got a teleporter, some sort, a visitor, not useful at the moment. Should probably get the pod a little bit closer. Eh, no, that's fine. And then shoot out the window. Take some guns, why not? And activate and leave and do not press F. There we go. 16 seconds. Seems about right for how freakishly long that one was. Yeah, there was zero chance of getting a perfect style on that one. Probably not good odds on this one as well, because we didn't get anything that speeds us up. In fact, all we got were more guns. Uh, we got heat sensors, we got emergency shields. And what was it? Reinforcements. second bonk into three second donk dock hard not to say donk um okay so we can just ignore them we can get the key this might maybe be worth stealing eh might go for that crate Pretty sure this is one that's not going to be under 10 seconds. Bonk. Really should have shot them to save a little bit of time. So we're at four. There's like five, six, seven ish. Just going vaguely. So since we're going to be over 10 anyways, let's take a detour to get a crate. That's Nearly worthless. It's only worth is that if ship three has explosives, explosive people, uh, I don't blow them up. It's a pretty narrow use case, especially when I already have a conch hammer. to be careful because you do have a shield if I'm not careful yep there we are at seven seconds and for this we get another teleporter a sidewinder see that's actually useful step out of there doesn't matter which one I go out of, it doesn't really matter which window I go out of. So we'll go down here. Do we get a second one? We do! Then we can shoot this out. And activate and leave and do not press F. Until now. Alright. 11 seconds, quite good. Significantly faster than ship one. A ship one had a lot of backtracking.
armor everywhere. That's a bit annoying. A predator. We don't get them too often. That could prove a problem. Defenders. Defenders could also be an issue, potentially. Let's see, what have we got? Wait, what did we pick up? Oh, right, we didn't get anything from the target because we turned the target in. That's right. Yeah, so far we've only got guns as loot. Uh, visit could get us in here, but it's not likely to save us time over to just going through here. Reinforcement, so it is not orbiting. Two. Two second talk. A. Hey. That is a mighty unfortunate position. No, 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 that's not too bad. We can shoot the predator. If this was like no harm, this would be very sketch. It's still gonna be annoying because we need to actually get down here and get your key or like throw the acid trap at you and wait for that, but. We can take care of the def or the defender, the predator at the very least. I'll do a couple shots just to make sure I don't miss. And then I've got a lot of these charges, so I'm just going to be fine with Taking out the armor of a couple of unrelated people. And then we need to wait. And then shooting you should be fine. And I don't care about the alarm, probably. Yeah, I'm probably avoiding that area anyways. This will probably be a visit get in maybe visit to get in visit to get out maybe we'll see how patrols look Ooh, we have a, another blade or a melee weapon at least okay so where are, are we actually going from here this key we have to go a bit out of our way for this key we have to go a bit out of our way but it's along the path Neither one strikes me as particularly good, so I'm just going to go down here. Let's pick that up. Head over here. The nicest thing to crash blade can actually be used to take out the defender. That's our only option there. I was about to stab this guard with it to get there closer or to get there faster. But now that I think about it, it's a better idea. Oh, I shot the person that was being flung back. It's a better idea to save that for when we actually can use the crash. Look at them shooting each other. <clears throat> okay. Ew, look at the time. I got three or so minutes. Let's speed this up. Ah, I was hoping that wouldn't be a bash. Eh, it's not the worst bash in the world. They at least got you out of the way. It's not like... This is a wrench with a really long cooldown. Okay, so you're not in range. Let's pick up one of these. I 
we can get in here, we can get that key pretty easily. Which means we can probably get out through there. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a a visit. Let's get the pod moving a bit because we're not quite in line or in range. So we go bloop and go bloop. Take a couple. Nope, still in throw mode. Or whatever mode. Alright, so now we stab you. We can tell you to back off. Oh. And let's see what we've got in the crate. We got a teleporter? We got a sidewinder, that's fantastic. So we can just walk up here, go up here, and then go. Boop. And there we go. Activate field, leave without pressing F. And there we go, 13 seconds, fantastic. So yeah, no way this was done being done in under or above a 585 or 485. I'm quite happy with that. And we had just just a minute left to submit the score. So we're safe. We're safe. All right. Really quite happy with that. As always with Bash Dash, that gives quite, quite an edge in time. But still, I'm quite happy. Yesterday, 7th of March, we have me in first place with the same score as today. If S. Sushiki in second, pretty fast, 55 seconds. We have Rond in third, Det Majner in fourth, and Zazaza coming up in fifth place. Good job, everybody. And with that, that is the end of today's daily challenge, and this is a preview of what we've got tomorrow. Ooh, we're swapping in. We're swapping in, and we're allowed to kill the people. That sounds like fun. This is gonna be a fast one. Nice. I think we've got a glitcher stick. Ooh. Is this gonna be... This might... This could be a fabled uh, 600 score one. Because we got the swapper for the first two, and then slipstream plus swapper for ship three, and because we have this glitch tick, we get there fast, but then we can also capture the target, catch ourselves, and then redock and get their items. So if we get any more teleporters from there, we have an okay chance at getting in on ship three. It's also off-world. If we get lucky on off-world and get to the center of the ship, that cuts down on a lot of time as well. So yeah, who knows? Maybe tomorrow has the workings of a 600. Maybe it doesn't. But that is all for today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow.